how many of you guys know somebody who is vaccine injured? And how many of you guys know somebody who died after getting the vaccine? So that's even in itself shopping. How many of you guys know somebody who uh, died healthy person after getting COVID? Nobody. You have to have seen some of this on your own basis, correct? Everybody, everybody's seen this. What has the effect been on those people? If you know these people, how is the army taking care of these people who have been injured after being forced to get the shot? From what I've seen with my, some of my soldiers that are going through it, it's kind of case dependent on severity. If they're ruling it severe enough, you know, they can go through the med board process and get out with some benefits. And others who are having, hate to say, more mild symptoms, heart palpitations, chest pains, breathing problems, stuff like that, they're giving them what is a called a Chapter 514 medical. And it's a, essentially just a separation out of the Army with no benefits other than what their normal separation would allow them. Yeah. One of the guys that, that I'm friends with, he um, really didn't want to take it, but he felt like he had to just be able to stay in. And then he got back from injury from it and is now having to get out. Are they even offering up anything to these people? Like, hey, we're sorry that we forced you to get this thing we said was safe and effective and now you're injured and can't work anymore, can't carry out the job you could previously carry out, no longer the healthy, strong person you used to be. So here's this big bonus. We're so sorry for destroying your life. Is there anything? They like serve no bonuses. No, and I didn't think so. A lot of times from what I've seen, none of the times have they directly acknowledged that it's from the vaccine, even though this perfectly healthy individual who, you know, has a ranger tab, who's seen as this very physical specimen, if you will, you know, within the battalion, can't even go run a mile anymore without, you know, his heart rate spiking to 170, 180 beats a minute. 